We continue the second of the bridegroom services. Christ, and you see the eyes of Christ in, the, in our midst. It's the bridegroom of the church. The church is us, the Christians, the people of today. And there are different images given in today's services. by liturgy, there is a, a beautiful gospel on the ten virgins, five were foolish and five were wise, and they, they were preparing to meet the bridegroom. The five foolish ones did not prepare their lamps. The wise ones were prepared, and the unwise ones had to go out and buy oil for their lamps, but it was too late by the time they came back. The bridegroom came, and the virgins that were prepared entered into the wedding feast. What does this all say to us? What is, what is the message to us? The Christ is our bridegroom. See the image of Christ sad. Our bridegroom is sad. Why? Because of our sins. Because of our unpreparedness like the five foolish virgins. To our sins. We're not preparing ourselves to meet Christ. In our, in our lives. Think of the oil lamps. The oil in those lamps that we prepare are the good works we do to our brothers and sisters in the world. Good works. Remember the Gospel in St. Matthew of the Last Judgment? I was hungry and he gave me food or the opposite. He gave me no food. I was thirsty, he gave me drink. No drink. I was in prison and he came to visit me. No visit me. I was a stranger and he did not welcome me. I was sick and in prison he did not visit me. The vigilance we are to prepare are our souls to be Christ. Every person we encounter from day to day is an opportunity to meet Christ. Meet Christ in every 